Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm gonna to go ahead and continue on with the Jeep build. As you can see here, I started to tear into it a little earlier before the video started, but hey, you know, keep moving forward. Um, I'm gonna to try to go and square up this clay setup here and um, get that nice and square, get everything smoothed out, uh, continue on to the rear section. Uh, continue making the molds, taking the forms of each one of these uh, panels and hopefully get into the final, the final design of the vehicle. So we're going to see how far I can get in this video, so uh, stick with me. Let's get it. Everything is uh, squared up again. Uh, I'm going to do the same process as the last video and um, go ahead and do the the, um, the installation tape and then on top of that do the um, then we do the RT the PVA um, glue PVA adhesive and then we go ahead and do the um, gel coat fiberglass take the part off move on to the next part. Um, I wouldn't normally do the whole door again, once again, out of clay. So I'm gonna have to go order more clay. But for now, for this video, I'm gonna go ahead and just um, continue doing how I'm doing it now until the clay comes in, which is probably not gonna come in anytime soon since you know the delays with the shipping and all that stuff. So um, yeah, I'm just gonna keep on pushing as, as much as I can until it's finished. So I'm gonna take a this uh, mold on top because it's not going to be the whole door skin it's just going to be individual parts and then I'm going to come back later on after I do the final part and I'm going to um, panel bonder and um, I'm going to bond these to the body panel permanently it's going to be in little sections on this door this rear door will be full section and as, as um, the quarter panels as well so I will do panel bond on the back quarter panels and the doors and everything else. The only thing that's being on its own part would be the front fender, but everything will be bonded to the actual metal of the vehicle. So I'm not gonna skin this door with fiberglass. I'm just gonna do each individual parts and then panel bond everything to the body. So let's go ahead and prep this up and get this ready for fiberglass.
All right, we're back at it again. This is the next day. As you've seen in the last clip, I ran out of daylight. So uh, first thing I'm gonna do is run to the local paint store and go pick up some fiberglass resin. All right, yeah, man. All right, made it back from the hardware store. I did uh, wind up stopping by Home Depot and picking up some um, dressers so I could clean up outside the house. So um, yeah, I picked up these. And um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and use these um, to clean up this work area that I have over here. It's uh, a little messy, so I'm gonna clean that up for the rest of the evening and uh, I don't know I think that's gonna be it for this video today Just playing with you, man. Uh, I'll hit you guys on another video, on the next video coming up. Um, I'm trying to get a schedule. I think I'm about to start scheduling my videos. That's kind of hard when you got a lot of wait time and stuff like that with in between coats and fiberglass resin and all that other stuff. So uh, yeah, it takes very a lot of time. So hopefully I can finish out these panels and uh, move in faster and get more videos out there. Uh, with more of the stuff that I'm gonna do with suspension and engine hopefully and interior work and all that other stuff so Stay tuned like subscribe comment all that good stuff and we'll see you next time Peace Share the video if you can because the more shares I get the more likes I get on the video The bigger and better the channel will get and it will grow faster uh, Y'all will help me with that so Please do. If not, hit the like button and get the out of here, man. Peace.